Okay. Call the meeting to order at 5.33. Um, I'd entertain a motion to approve the minutes. Do we have a quorum right now? Well, they were... I, With so the Andrew, here's a confusion, we have one, I think. you know, three months into this project. When Christy sends it out, she doesn't send them all to you. But I didn't get anything. Well, we haven't approved I've, any for a long time. Right. I was going to bring know, that up today. I don't, the, the, the last one. That's why there's four of them listed. Right. When we met last, or well, we two, week, two weeks ago. Right. Two weeks ago, we just, I said. We just went into on. it. We just went into it. Yeah. And before <laughs> that, we didn't have, have a quorum. quorum. Right. Right. So, um, so you don't have them. See, I was making an assumption. She no, no, no. We, she sends probably. the draft minutes out. She okay, sends them to you. Oh, do I have that printed out? No, I'm asking, do we have a quorum oh. to review the minutes? That's still good. There are 13 of us. Is that correct? Right. So we've got a quorum now. Because we've got... Emily might have made the quorum. Yeah. Well, I think... You made the quorum. I think yeah. you made oh. the quorum. Oh, phew. What do you have? I have some snacks. You checked a box. You checked both boxes. Yeah. <laughs> yes, multiple. Oh, no, we're good now. Ah, okay. Oh, okay. There's, There's 11. more than half. Yeah. <clears throat> Well, since we have a quorum, I'd entertain a motion to approve the minutes of May 16th, May 30th, June 13th, and July 11th. What's the NA for, do you know? Uh, was July 11th our last meeting? Yeah, yeah have we not gotten the minutes from Okay. <laughs> All right, so <laughs> strike what, July 11th. Was that like a passive aggressive? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. Maybe. Oh, that's probably beautiful. <laughs> Mary taxed me with it, and I, uh, I, have I didn't rise to her standards, I but... <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you, I, I bought a brownie. <laughs> we have brownies at this meeting. <laughs> <laughs> yes, mm. busy. I thought of it, and then we're getting Sorry. ready to go away. All else we're fails, bring chocolate. Try the vote. That's That's right. <laughs> yay, yay, and yay. I make a motion to the first three. Okay. <laughs> 2.1 to 2.3. Did I see the minutes? No. I oh, okay. Yeah, because I have it. Let me see if I have it. Come Andrew's song. Well, I'm on the email list with, uh, you know, Christy, that Christy sends out because I'm on the board, so. Oh. You know. So you okay, well, I'm going to have to fix that. that. And I'm not positive that I see <laughs> I don't. Okay. I don't know that I have, and I, I, don't, I, I don't do think I have. Okay, time. I've just, I've been making sort of that mm -hmm. assumption that when she set out the agenda, because I can see that it's multiples, but well, you know, maybe it's one of those blind copy thingies, so I can't figure out who, either, they, who it so. is. I don't see the agenda. Usually, the agenda she sends either. out. No. She, I just get your emails being like, oh, see you Thursday. Yeah. 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 Okay. I get you. Yeah. I will get on that. I will, I'll forward sorry. this just, email to everybody. Those are not assumptions I should make. Yeah. <laughs> All right. It's not like the Let's check. Um, no, I will fix that. So. I've only got this one out of habit. I guess I don't need it. I should get on the online. It's hard because you don't know who it goes to because it's Christy Blind copies everybody. Yeah. Right. I, that's why. I, oh. And I just never emailed her and say who said who's on your blind copy. I just yeah. Okay. Made, yeah. Well, it was like you when know, when you text I, I me for the fans, I hadn't put your you know associated you with a number. I assumed oh. who it was, you know, but I hadn't <laughs> gone through all those motions, you know, yet or whatever. So it's fine. I know. I knew. I knew who it was. So it was. Yeah. Yeah. I got it. Don't worry. <laughs> I appreciate that. Of course, today is beautiful, and we would be fine. No, no it's all right. That's a mess but... down there. You okay. wouldn't want to be in. Well, no. This time of year, it's, I can remember. Right. It's like... I just forwarded the email Christy sent out. To everybody that has okay, the thank you. I will, an agenda um, in it. I suppose we should look at those before we approve them, eh? Should we, we can put them up on there? Minutes. Do we have, I don't know, yeah, there you are. That's the password, too, if you want to get on the Wi Fi. That's it. I think. Um, oh, it was up there. Wrong. Yeah, cap. I got it just from regular, regular. Oh, there you go. Well, those are the first minutes. Anyone not want to approve those? They look very straightforward. That sounds great. Yeah, yeah the attendance is the only. Thing. Uh, I think the attendance I just went by. That's all. It's there. Oh, I was there. 
<laughs> that so was long ago. Meeting. I know. Yeah. It's our first meeting. Isn't it? Yeah, uh, May 16th. Yep. Yeah. 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 May 30th. Yeah. Yeah, these all look very straightforward and easy to approve <laughs> to me. <laughs> it's always that, but you can't capture anything. I try to capture it. You know, hmm. Easter. I go around and around sometimes. My folks. Right, and there's one canceled one too. So, yeah, yeah, which I could have gone to. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you need a motion to approve the minutes then? I think we have a motion. You have oh, yeah. seconded. I seconded. Okay. Yeah. All, all in favor, say aye. 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 <coughs> okay, the minutes are approved. Oh, those three minutes are approved. Okay. Uh, Do we have any public comment? Okay. Would you like to take over right. for discussion? So, um, just another, I just never want to forget to say how much I appreciate you coming out on these days in the summer and, and carving out this time. I think you guys are doing great work. And I was anticipating when, when um, Jamie first asked me to do this that it was like, you want us to do what in the summer? And it has to be done by the end of September. Are you nuts? And, um, Mm -hmm. Yeah, then we're going to do it. So that's awesome. Anyway, um, so I wanted to to bring. We ran into just sort of a stall in the um, with the uh, family survey. What is it? Oh, I'm looking at the wrong agenda. That's why I'm a little confused here. Um, anyway, what was what was? The, yes. Sorry. Thank you. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, family you know, the data collection. Okay, so the family survey. Um, we were trying to get this to include. Um, well, Andrew, you want to? Why don't you and I have been talking about it and just speak to what what we were trying to do when we talked to to Ray tonight. And well, so partly on. we were in a stall because Jamie was on vacation. <laughs> Him right out of the <laughs> Get to the real reason. Uh, well, that, but I think that's legitimate because he and yeah, I talked about it. it. He had been very supportive, but the kinds of things yeah. that I was looking for, I felt strongly, should not come from this woman from up the, so, up the yeah. road. And I was only you able know, to asking principals to do things. Yeah. I know them, but that it needed to come from him. And I was so, only yeah. able to discuss this with him this afternoon, <laughs> and then that was my first chance to see Ray. So eh, I don't know that Jamie got to him before me. So, uh, but I heard him say was that my idea that you can just blackboard the last five years is not possible. But I did also hear him say we do have all those email addresses. So I think that there is probably a way to figure out how to target just families um, and staff or, you know, if we wanted to think back to staff, too, over the last five years of the merger. So I well, we did staff, so I don't... Right. But if we wanted to make sure other... Be, well, the, yeah, the staff safe. that's not there now, maybe the we've lost since then for whatever or whatever if that's going backwards we, we don't need to go backwards yeah. but right, I, right. I've, I've, right. I'm going to guess he's going to ruminate on it and we'll come back to it <laughs> tomorrow yeah, so, <laughs> so if it had been as simple as just putting it out to families right now it would have gone out last week but it, and we, we can't put it out to our to current families it's just about how to capture those right. last four year the past families ones, yeah. and I was um, which are a lot of repeats but not exactly yeah. right that's the there's just, yeah. I mean, yeah. You can, does yeah. does I think it's just guidance just counseling it's keep track of graduates at least? We have all that information okay. digitally because all I have to do is literally change the school year on Web to School, and I can search anyone who's was here that year. So it's a matter of picking them. It's it's easier. It's easy for us to go back and get the the seniors that have graduated over those last few years and those families. Um, and we do have we do have I think accurate records of like who's moved out if we want them as well. But well, we should yeah we should certainly with kids that transferred yeah and why maybe well I mean generally it's they moved <laughs> move, yeah move up 
just transferred records with. Oh, there would be, yeah. There would be some kind of record of that. But anyway, so it was a little bit more complicated than we anticipated, but we're, but it should go out the next couple of days. And um, and like I say, we're going to try to capture the last five years and then graduate. So that'll be exciting to have that. Um, the other, I have to find my notes on this. Oh, there. there. Um, Sandy, you want to talk about what you did? Okay. I asked her. And I, can somebody please pronounce Nancy's last name? Pageway. Pageway. Pageway? Okay. Pageway. You hear yeah, little variations like. of it, but yeah. 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 <laughs> we, ha we have friends that have a last name, and the right way to say it is so different okay. from the well, same mm -hmm. thing. So anyway, I had approached Sandy and, and Nancy about checking in with their, their respective town clerks around families that we're moving in. And I don't know where Nancy is with that. With okay. Well, I went and saw Carmen, and she said, well, I don't know if I can really help you specifically, but so I went through f almost five years of real estate transactions. And um, a lot of mobile homes, a lot of out-of-state real estate um, partnerships in other states that had bought investment properties. Um, there have been, she said that a lot of secondary homes were bought and went to primary residences and a lot of primary residences went to secondary homes. And she said they equaled they equaled out. So we haven't had a big influx of secondary home people, you know, go the amount going right. up compared. They canceled each other out. They canceled each other out. So that was that. Um, basically, I went also, um, I said earlier, 2,700 approximately people, population. 87% of those are registered voters. So... The other is either not registered or children. Yeah. So it says 18, which makes sense, 18.8% uh, are children. I looked that up in the census. And we have 524 housing units. Now this, this is what really looked off that the median income is $92,854 as of the last census. And in the report that we put, that, that the school put out for the, you know, was like 34, wasn't it like yeah. 34,000? I'm thinking, what, it, what, why is there such a discrepancy unless they didn't, was it the median or the mean or? It said median income. So. Yeah, that would be surprising. Yeah, <laughs> I know, I know, I know. Great, but yeah. I, think, I know, I'm going, where are we, Norwich? Half people are above um, <laughs> Was it for the county or was it for the town? Town. Hmm. Our town census, I'm thinking, weird. Huh. weird. But um, I have Kendra and Ray working on who moved in, who moved out, uh, and where they went to if they moved out, just to... You know, are they leaving because they don't look, want to be with us or due to housing or whatever? And she said it was going to take a few more days. So okay. otherwise, I mean, basically. And for, are we thinking of sending those people like a family survey or a community survey? Whatever that Well, that's sort of to be decided. Yeah, yeah. So if you can, I mean, one way or another, if they're, if they're approachable on the, on the family survey, sure. As long as you get the data, I would think. Yeah, and if we have, if there's a way in the very beginning of the survey that they could, would they be able to identify themselves? Mm. I mean, we, we do have a fluid population that comes and goes, and sometimes they come back. And yeah. What town do you live in is the second question. I mean, yeah, what town do you live in? It's just those two. It's just a fill-in question, though. I mean, this was the yeah. draft, so. Right, that's, this is the. Do we have an other in the, the town do you live in? Yeah, or just I think a it's a fill-in, not a. 
Yeah, you're right. Um, I mean, part of it was we were just asking, you know, just the general question of how many, you know, what is the mm -hmm. sorry, just how many, chance, we how many people have moved in. <laughs> I think ultimately that may have been driven by are they moving here because of the school or are they moving away because of the school, I think. Right. I thought it was because of choice. Yeah. Like, choice. Oh, yeah. I have a parent lives in this town and in this town, but I choose this yeah. one or yeah. Um, or you have Pittsfield. parents that are separated, that one lives yes. in Bethel, but one lives in yeah. Pittsfield or Randolph or whatever. Yeah. yeah. Maybe there's not. Well, thank you. This may yeah. end up being yeah. more than what we actually needed. But okay. I would say it's really interesting stuff. Yeah. And it might be things that, that other, other groups within the, the school community can use. I mean, there ways. are a lot of um, multi-family, you know, apartments yeah. that got sold and then they say investment on the on the transfer tax and things so yeah mm -hmm. yeah the airbnb ones and stuff like that mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah okay well thank you very yep. much yep. and um i will touch base with nancy uh let's see what happened there so the other piece was um so we had a list of other data um there were questions around the community well, they were sort of around the community uh, survey, but they wouldn't be found there. It was, you know, did, did the district save money? And that whole efficiency thing. So that's all sitting in budgets. So these are things that I believe um, is data that we already have that I just need. Um, Jamie's, uh, and, I, and I, he just said, give me the list. <laughs> I'll send him the list tomorrow. Because um, I just think the request, it's, it's not appropriate for me to be asking people. Uh, principals to stop what they're doing and do this. So, did yeah, did the dis? The budget stuff too, so What's that? I've got oh, okay, stuff, so. okay. Well, I'll let him know that. <laughs> um, there was also a question, and this would be for the community uh, survey: was are there lingering bad feelings? I think Sandy, actually, you might have been the person who brought that up, and have that you know has that been healed? I don't know. We're going to talk about the community survey in a few minutes. I don't know how we might approach that. Um, but it was a lingering question because it was. I mean, you guys went through a whole series of yeses and nos, and it took you uh, several um, pieces of the journey to get where you are. So I think it was particularly painful um, at times. Tax rates, have they stabilized? I think, you know, that's an easy question, but I think that being able to, when I think about the report, be, th this data would go in as an appendix in the report to show, you know, the five years, and then the, the report would speak to that. But then the nice part about it is that all that information will be in one place. And some of it may already be there because of your uh, report, the way you communicate around your budgets. Um, that may already be there. Um, there was also a question about the effectiveness of the SU board and whether or not towns were appropriately um, represented. I'm really sure how to ask that question either. Um, there was also, is there evidence of strong connections between the community and the schools? So I got to thinking a lot about this community connection because when we first started the, um, I think the family survey, I think I said something about all schools you know, tr struggle with. I think it was, that was more specific to families, but connections. Um, and, uh, and Chris, you called me out on being negative about it and saying, you know, so we got rid of the word challenge. But it, but what was really driving me was, what is the vision of strong community, not school community, but community community connection with the school? You know, what 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 is the evidence that there's a strong connection? And I don't really have an easy answer for that. I've seen a change over the time that I've worked was a parent, worked, and now still are in and out of the school mm -hmm. regularly. Um, we used to hire a lot of girlfriends, partners, wives, husbands connected to the law school. Oh, I mean, David D. Simone went to law school, then he went back to school, then 
is down at school, and and Trinity started off as as the behavior person in the in the office, and and evolved and and ended up being a really good English teacher, but I can remember a para, um, her significant other was Doris Kearns Goodwin's son. I mean, people like that. Um, you know, there was there was an influx of solid, good staff that would come, and I haven't seen that in the last maybe five to ten years. This is going back pretty far, but um, it was a good conduit to mm -hmm. keep people in the outside the school community aware of what was going on in the school. So well, I, I don't. I, hmm. Well, yeah, we, I mean, we've, we've kind of, our, our, our PTOs have kind of faded. Our boosters aren't what they used to. We're working on bringing them back okay. and bringing them, raising them back up. But, um, you know, I don't, it's just like, you know, pre and post COVID and societal mm -hmm. things have changed, like mm -hmm. things are just different now. And so it's, it's harder to, to kind of grasp some of this True. things well, that yeah. we, we used to be norms of, you know, like stuff. And now we're, we're in a, um, a different security phase and, you know, like HEPA phase and, 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 you know, FERPA and all that or whatever. So, you know, we, 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 we tend to try to, to vet more and think more. And before we might have people fill out a form, but it was like, yeah, come on into the classroom or whatever. So it's, and, and on the flip side, I'd say it's not for not trying. I mean, I've right. sent over to the law school, like, here's yeah. some openings yeah. we have. Please yeah. share them yeah. with yeah. anybody yeah. who yeah. <laughs> wants to yeah. Yeah. check them yeah. out. Yeah. And I don't know where those people have gone. And yeah. I, mean, I know just a few years ago, right, was it the law school kind of talking about maybe mentoring not, or even closing at one point, weren't yeah. they? Yeah. Yeah. So I feel like yeah. they're on challenging times and it's yeah. a... Yeah, just the hiring, hiring situation in general, like, mm -hmm. the, it's, it's very tight The population hasn't really changed that Absolutely. much either. It's just the makeup, I think, of the population. Just a little bit older. Yeah. Well, and so I'm wondering. <laughs> for your son. <laughs> You're the career <laughs> state. Uh, those blue-haired ladies in the, you know. No, so the original question was about the, like, community <coughs> connections, and I think people working school is one aspect of it but there's mm -hmm. also you know like people getting the high school um, sports things being an event or right. Right. That's sport. Right. Yeah. Yeah. attending an event or maybe sponsoring an event maybe paying for an ad in a program for the play that kind of thing yeah. Yeah. in the elementary we really I challenged each teacher to bring the community in, maybe not the community like this, but you know, have their parents come in for something. So we had people put on plays. We Tiffany Bates did this big trout release. A lot of people involved with that, <laughs> yeah, right? Great. So it looked different depending on the ages. The mm -hmm. preschool and kindergarten have their own thing that they do every year, mm -hmm. but. Um, used to do like a tea, right, or whatever. The, you know, the first grade, grade teachers tea. did a writer's yeah. tea. tea, yeah. Whoops. So. But I don't know that the greater community would all have it wouldn't have touched all of them necessarily. Well, I just think it's a it's a question worth sort of asking myself. Yeah. Because it would it, it might impact how you ask the community those kinds of questions. I know that in the in the family survey we had a fairly extensive um, list of including board members. I think when you weren't here, we added to the list of you know ways you might be interested in oh, sure, yeah. contributing to the school and we i think we put bus drivers got mm -hmm, it mm -hmm. got added and uh, some different folks like that but um but i got to thinking more about it and thinking that maybe it does have to do with like attending attending events that maybe you don't have kids or grandchildren mm -hmm. um participating in or maybe you're contributing to the new scoreboard the one in the old gym, and my husband and Charlie Welch paid for that. 
there you go. <laughs> well, I think those are the, the conversations that we're, we try to get to, like, moving forward. Like, we've had conversations about the playground, and that was a, a community PTO, like, driven yeah. thing years ago. And, and for some yeah. reason, that all, a lot of that stuff is kind of um, fallen off, and maybe it's the digital age or, you know, whatever, like, you know, where people aren't quite as connected or connected in different ways. So, you know, but I, I think as we're trying to get back to the, the boosters and the PTO, you know, like those Phoenix ex Phoenixes could arise, you know, right. I think. I, th I th yeah. think if we, we, as a collective, as a village, you know, we, we you know, do it. But it's going to take time, time and energy. I think this will be a hard one to measure a change because like we can see kind of what people respond now but we have no idea really what it was kind of before you know there's no way to kind of measure right so maybe it's more about trying to get a snapshot of what's now now or perception i mean i think yeah. too that right. people forget i mean you were talking about the playground i mean the the buildings and the grounds belong to the towns you know so the playground is located at the school and you're responsible for making sure it's safe and all those kinds of things but the expectation is is that the families will use it um, throughout the, the weekend and things like that. I mean, or the motorcycle DMV is <laughs> used to use our parking lot mm -hmm. um, and we could to teach people how to ride motorcycles. But the idea being that is the community, even because we have questions about facilities, how people look at the facilities or how the schools are viewed from outside the community, are, are the communities um, you know, are they thinking about the school facilities as being something that might um, support something that they're doing? I don't know if you have an annual craft fair that is located at one of the schools or just at the local it used church. Used to be a quilt fair. That's you know, those, all those things kinds of things. Away. I think that those kinds of things, you know, are somewhat of an indication, at yeah. least that the that the buildings and the schools are belong, you know, truly belong to the community. They have their own, that has their own challenge, um, but um, but I think that the you know having that would be something to think about trying to to uh, to obtain you know that kind of kind of thought process on the on the community's part if they're planning some kind of a celebration or a centennial or whatever that that somehow that the school facilities might be might be used for that. I think it would be interesting to know too, like people in Bethel say, who maybe never came to the South Royalton campus now, are you mm -hmm. connected to that? Like, because mm -hmm. that is new. That's yeah. brand new. I'd never been to this campus, I don't think, before the merger. So. Well, yeah. now we have our end of the year celebration there. We, you know, go for events and, you know, yeah. like, you know, things that we never really were. Except we have meetings there and, and you know, whatever. So, yeah. you know, yeah. like. That was a big deal. It would just be interesting to, yeah, I think it will be an interesting thing. Do you see it as one school? Yeah. Or do you see it as, yeah, hard so, to get at. So anyway, community schools, um, we had a whole thing about attracting tuition students. I know that there have been very specific activities going on within the SU to attract um, Chelsea and, and Tunbridge kids, uh, for sure. Chelsea kids, they have to take their kids. And, um, and then I think they've gone out farther than that. I think Thetford, I think we have, if I understand, if I'm remembering correctly, you may have more kids from Thetford huh. this coming year than you ever had. Just, they, which would be an interesting on? thing, because Thetford is Thetford. Yeah, right. that's pretty far. Yeah. Over the hill. <laughs> no, <it's just> <laughs> over a lot of hills. But there are <laughs> a couple of kids who came, and then when you get them coming in pairs, they do tend to, yeah. 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 What about Stratford? Do we the ever, do, you know, Stratford, like when my husband grew up, and then my kids, there were a lot more kids from Stratford that came here than... Right. Yeah, I, don't, I mean, that will be part of that, and that's information we can certainly certainly get. One of the, one of the keys to tuition students um, sometimes is transportation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Send a bus to Thetford. I think kids. it's also where the parents work, too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. It, it, those choices are so rarely really about education. Right. It's about convenience. Yeah. Well, I, yeah, I it goes back to the same thing. It's, it's like taking the bus, right? I don't take the bus. You put it on the, you know, because right. 
you're, I'm driving by to go to work. But if your work situation changes, well, that snapshot now isn't, you know what I mean? So it's. And then industry choice was the last one. So anyway, all those things, um, we, have the, we have that data. And we'll um, get it and get it in a workable format, which is really the challenge. So questions or additions to that in terms of those things that we're sitting on? That Do we have a um, anticipated like schedule for when we're going to do the community and get the community survey out to people? Well, I don't think it's going to, yes, I would say that, that we ought to be able to, we ought to have, we'll have something in two weeks okay. to respond to, because I'm not expecting that to be particularly long. I don't think it's going to mm -hmm. be anything like what we've been doing. So that's what we're going to talk about two seconds. I haven't been on the other surveys, but have how have the responses been on those? The Is response any? on the, the teacher and student were good. We had, I don't know, six, 60, mm -hmm. 61? I, ha I haven't I been on the look. Okay. I don't have that look. Yeah. Yeah. No, just generally, that's fine. Yeah, no, yeah. no, no. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I was surprised. A lot of them wrote a lot of yeah, in-depth comments, which was helpful. Yeah. yeah. The students, not quite as much, but <laughs> it was a little more cool. brief. But cool. I'm saying cool. 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 <laughs> okay. That was That's more than grunt. <laughs> yeah. Skippy. Um, so what I wanted to do from here is to talk more about the community survey and what the what the general questions or what we're looking for give give some idea on how we want what we want to ask, or do we? No, I mean, do we start just with like the family survey and then strip yeah. out the ones that are family specific and then add in the ones that are community specific, or like we what's- We can certainly do it that way. Well, how do we want to approach it? I mean, I'm just thinking that a lot of the stuff that we asked families, and I mean, we took the teacher and we pared that one down for families, and there were a lot of the discussions where, we, you know, families, parents really know the answers to these questions. We took those out. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, I think teacher engagement and, and innovative instruction, I don't know what the community would do with that, student-adult relationships, all of, you know, most everything is about really inner workings of the school and school structures. Right. Yeah, they probably, school, school structures, they would probably have an opinion yes. on. Yes, well, certainly school structures. It, but, I mean, you could ask anything you want, but <laughs> is their opinion on it, is that important? Informative. What does that mean? Does that just mean I don't like it? Or does it mean, what does that mean? Do you mean structures on how the school, um, like one section's here and yeah, yeah. Yeah. that yeah. kind of stuff? Elementary, I mean, yeah. knowing the elementary like in both campuses, yeah. how important that is for people is an important. Yeah, I think so too. I think that's. I mean, certainly. I feel like that's kind of what drove a lot of this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, in order to get a change, like it would have to be approved by the voters, which are the community. So, yeah. you know, that's yeah. an important one to ask for sure. Okay. Two. Okay. So really, they could be similar to how we asked them in the family survey, which was, was that a good idea? Is putting them back together, or putting them together a good idea? Oh yeah, I think that would be that, important, yeah. Yeah, yeah. the yeah. way to ask yeah. them. They might yeah. need a little more like information if they're not actually up yeah. to no, speed no, 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 on no. things. Two yeah. schools, <laughs> one campus, yeah. you know, yeah. right, or yeah. whatever, yeah, or one, yeah. I think that for the community survey, it's less important to drill down by mm -hmm. programs. And more I, by right. town, maybe. And more well, if the answer, if the first one of the first questions is what town do you live in, that would be handy. But I think a general, in general, they, to hear what their perception is about do our students excited about school, we believe yes. I mean, I don't. I mean, maybe that's not a good example, but getting their perception of what they think the children in their town, how their children in their town feel about their school, or whether or not they're connected at all, would be interesting to me. Or yeah, if you're a community member, you do you general feel general perception like, of the school? How do you view it? Yeah. Well, how do they view it? Right. How do you think kids view yeah. it? How do you? Like, I think most of these questions, but just dial it back, and it, mm -hmm. then it's either they, you know, bigger umbrellas, but a bigger but, umbrella, but yeah. it's like, yeah, yeah. strongly yeah. agree. Yeah. I don't know that range. Yeah. It would just help us know 
on the flip side, do are people really feeling connected to the school? Because mm-hmm. if they answer can a bunch of I don't know, like can we mm-hmm. ask directly? Like a scale. How do you? Yeah. yeah. How do you feel? Do you feel connected to the school? Enough? Not enough? More than you want to be? Less than you want? You know what I mean? Because. You know, some people are like, I'm not connected because why would I be? Yeah. You know? I just pay my taxes and then well, I'm that, that's, that's when the, I get the that's bill. That's the thing. Is, are we going to look at these as the group of people that we haven't already targeted with a survey? So it's either right. like they're far <clears throat> enough out of the, the window we're looking at that their children, they either they don't have children they're recently moved in the community and they their kids have gone through the system but it was years ago you know what i mean so yeah. farther wow. than that so they're they're just de facto not connected because they they've already they've been through it and they don't feel the need unless they want to like sub or boosters or you know like right. be involved in those like the gardens or you know whatever you know function it is but but I think a, it, a lot of them, I'm sorry. Go ahead. A lot of them are probably grandparents, aunts and uncles, well, right, right, neighbors, right, close right. enough to kids that they would might have an opinion. But that's yeah. interesting. Uh, or ge- there's generally the general impression out there of schools too. Mm-hmm. Right, yeah. right, right. Okay. Which is what we want to capture. Yeah. yeah. Is it? yeah. Or, or do we want to capture also like, like reason why you feel like you can't support the school too? Like I'm on a fixed mm-hmm. income, or yeah, yeah, I mean, I, yeah. I yeah. think Obstacles I think that yeah. yeah. Well, so that kind of gets into like, do you do we ask specifically about the taxation level or you know like, you know? Yeah, well, it depends yeah. on how those you're are, talking about supporting are, with time. Those are tough or weeds because it's the state. You, the state keeps moving the goal line. You know, do you, so you see the retirement community um, thought of in the budgetary <laughs> procedure? <laughs> But that's you know, you, get you know that assumption that we're only the community that we're not is only the retirement. No, but yeah, yeah, well, or low, you know, people who work in community. I mean, what we could do is feel the taxes are just too mm-hmm. too much for them, or whatever. What I what we could do is have survey questions that are like, which are the most important. Mm. Um, cohorts or not cohorts, but like I don't know what term to use, but group, your group, group connected to like you know who should we be concerned about when we're like mm-hmm. setting the budget? Like, are we looking at working families or single? You know, like maybe I don't know if that makes sense. Well, what about whether or not people maybe feel, mm-hmm. in regardless of what their financial situation is, is their tax money being, being used well? Judiciously for in the schools. Yeah, no, that's good. Are we being good stewards? Are we being good stewards of their tax dollars? Yeah, lovely. Yeah, yeah. I mean, there's always a. Sadly, there's just you know if 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 the families that that whose kids are all out of school now, it's like, you know, well, my, I, I supported the budget when my kids were in school, but they're not in school anymore, so I don't. <laughs> yeah. um, but I think that, yeah, asking whether or not, and what you were saying in terms of who, who. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if it's I good. I think we ought to reconsider that for everybody. Yeah. 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 You know, everybody's yeah. different, but, but yeah. are we using, and are we using the money Stewards. Responsibly. Yeah, no, responsibly. but responsibly. No, that's right. know, responsibly. And then where would you spend more and where would you spend less? Yeah. I mean, I mean, I mean so much of the budget is set yeah. either by the I, state, I the federal true. government, or yeah. contracts. I think that's why I, w- I would say that it should be just more open ended questions and that yeah. this might be the survey that we collate more. Mm. Okay. Because unfortunately, when you start with leading questions like, yeah. do you feel like you're taxed too much? Yeah. Hell yeah, we yeah. all do. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Does any of our dollars, you know, go as far, whether you're an administrator, a custodian, but a farmer? You know, like, you, no, you no. This, but the, is it is it our fault as a school? You, you know no. the whole group. Yeah. I mean, there's one group way over here, and then there's one group way over there, and they go back and forth and back and forth, and I'm going... Lord, well, that's this what having the community survey go out to everybody. You know, we can right. see yeah, it. can right. see it. Yeah. But the, yeah. we got to hit those people to give us their opinions 
so they don't squawk later on. Because they do. Well, they still yeah. will. Yeah. <laughs> still forever, well, but you, but you at least like, want to yeah. say, did you answer that? So I just yeah. think like some wide open questioning about what is your perception about the barriers of the school or, you know, what is, mm -hmm. what is the school doing well? Mm -hmm. I, I wonder mm -hmm. about like putting something together a little more just like just give us a, a big space of written stuff and just yeah. collating it. Yeah. Would it be good to ask questions like, do you know anyone who works in the school? Do you know anyone who has, or do you know any students in the school? Yeah. Like, just to get a to sense have, of like, have us yeah. know, where like, yeah. is their reality yeah. coming yeah. from? Yeah. 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 Have you ever attended a school board meeting? Mm -hmm. That's a good way yeah. to How do you keep people? up with the school's information? Yeah, you know? yeah certainly, yeah. I think the things that I am, I think are very important to get at in the community survey are how the communication with the overall community is like what having the how do you get information and mm -hmm. you know what's the best way of reaching you is yeah. definitely an important thing mm -hmm. um hmm. the yeah overall kind of taxation questions or money questions we could have that i think the annual meeting questions like have you attended why or why not would if you're not attending like would changing the date make a difference? Would changing the time make a difference? Would changing the day of the week make a difference? Would moving you know, to Australian it, ballot make a difference? Is that what you right. put that one out there? Yeah, yeah. That, right. that was a Pull big that right mistake. Off the, the family survey that yeah. Yeah. was in there. No, I don't, we haven't had questions about the annual meeting. No, we didn't ask any meeting. of those questions. Yeah. No. So those are really We're important, I think. Question. It sounds familiar. Uh, I brought it up. It's only been brought up every year. This is well plowed ground. <laughs> yeah, so all those things are really important. Um, then, um, actually, Sandy, you were saying that there was some kind of confusion this time about when you could vote and when you could Yeah, you know, may or may not on the front of the, that yeah. was, I thought, oh yeah, we can do Australian ballot for the whole budget. And I didn't read the whole warning. Oh, okay. And neither did my husband. And we thought, oh, we can go vote on that. And then it wasn't on there. And I thought, oh, crap. They voted on it the night before. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I just, yeah. I mean, that has a lot to do with what we had done during COVID and, yeah, and yeah. 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 changing was, over. Was, and been and just, special yeah. things. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah. Caused all sorts of trouble. But. Mm -hmm. Okay, yep. I mean, that's a little bit of communication so, problem. Communication, so. how that's happening with the community. Structure of schools, people said. Communication. Yeah, structure of schools is important. What was that? Voting. Structure of the school. Oh, structures, I've got that. Okay. Does, do, I have structures does community care about transportation? I don't know. Probably not. I would well, not. Not they might, though. I don't know. Are you during mud seasons? Yeah, that was, I was one of those. Depends on if they're gonna roads. have a kid in school or they've already had a kid. In, you know I couldn't even. I, I was supposed to oh, um, do SAT um, proctoring. I couldn't get out. Yeah, this year was bad. And yeah, and the people up the road from me were. <clears throat> that feels like a survey was, about the town. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, maybe it's best to just leave it That's different issues. <laughs> I think the family survey covered the transportation. Yeah, yeah. I think okay, it does. All right. Yeah. About, yeah. <laughs> How do you That's feel about the, your the, town road crew? The school, yeah, well, <laughs> the school doesn't make mud season, or, ta or, or the cost of the school doesn't oh. make mud season worse or better. Nature? What <laughs> yeah. do you think about yeah. climate well, change? Well, you know, the, the best is to use your driveway as a turnaround. Hmm. This is against yeah. the law. <laughs> <laughs> no, all go all right, let, me, let me go through what I have here. Right? So I have the campus questions. Um, general perceptions of the school, um, whether you're feeling connected to the school, how could schools be more connected, how could the schools be more connected to the schools. Mm -hmm. um, general impressions, most important, who should be concerned, who should be concerned about. Question about that one. Um, good stores of tax dollars. Um, I do like lifting the how would, would you ever be interested in helping out yes. question mm -hmm. out of the yeah. family survey? Yep. Because maybe we will get yep. some people that yep. do want to be more yep. connected and just needed to be asked. Well, well yeah, I, I was thinking, actually, Aaron, I don't know if it work for you because of what your, your medium or whatever it is as an artist, but, you know, just to have people come in, we used to have local artists just come in and set up and 
mm -hmm. do their stuff. <laughs> you know, mm -hmm. I don't mm -hmm. know what that's called, but you know, where kids would just walk by and sit open. And, and watch, just open an open studio, studio type yeah. mm -hmm. type thing. That well, they were community folks, but that could be any number of things. It wouldn't have to just be artists. That could make things that Is part of the perception or whatever that section was about like infrastructure? Like the buildings, like how, what do you think of the, I feel like there are probably a lot of feelings about the buildings themselves and like the heating, like all, I don't know, people, maybe that's more families and less community, but. No. I feel like we've heard that a lot the, in the past. The yeah. The tradition of the building? Yeah. Or, or do yeah. you feel like the buildings and grounds are being maintained properly? Like a rating on that? If they've been following, yeah. they should know that it has been. Like yeah. we, we've been moving in that direction. <clears throat> I mean, this is all, like, all focused around the merger in the, in the end, right? Like, how is the merge, how the merger go? How's it going? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we haven't really touched on that. <clears throat> I'm going to be a, a bit <laughs> blunt. I think people in South Royalton felt that, that we were helping pay for Bethel's upgrades. Okay. That, that were... Well, yeah, but, well that, the, that just, this yeah, is, yeah, I'm just the, saying. The same was true. We helped pay for the yeah. gym. So, you know, <laughs> Ways, it it went true. both ways, and when no, you really well, were logical, that bond was before, but still. it was still being well, paid. Off. No, it was yeah. still being paid. We didn't but, even have to take a bond off out for yeah. the yeah. heating upgrade. Yeah, you know, it paid for okay. itself. No, it paid for so. itself. Yeah. But that's that was a bad perception. perception. Yeah, I would yeah. pay for the survey to fuel mm. that too. Though. Yeah, I agree. So maybe not to ask about. It. Okay. <laughs> well, I, I mean, but it's, I it's I think out having there, having questions about the facility is not a bad idea you know like are facilities adequate are they you know i think also if, as long as we have those sections endings that say like anything else you yeah. want to tell us about this yeah. that will give them the opportunity yeah. to say they can vent so, and let you know how, damn it, how I they didn't feel want to pay for the heating system and that'd be fine <laughs> Yeah. yeah. But then you know yeah. Yeah. and it's not yeah exactly. and it's not yeah. bubbling yeah. under the surface right right which it tends to do well, I think too that you know sometimes the mergers, I mean that whole business of one town paying for somebody else's upgrades. Well, the upgrades are happening in the school that your kids are now attending, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and that kind of gets lost. In well, and and one uh, school's on a different rotation, or their their widget needs it, and the others don't, or yeah. whatever. So it's not, yeah, you know, okay. no, it's fine. Well, we could do this a couple of different ways. I could go away and try to do this. I could, you see, people have different sort of passions about these questions, if they want, want to grab a section, and... Um, I think it'd be fine for you to put it together. It. I just wonder, like Emily said though, I think Emily said, I just think there needs to be a lot more information at the beginning mm -hmm. than mm. what we've done before. The blocks that kind of like talk about the history mm -hmm. of what these questions are. Why are we asking these? I, I almost wonder if we need a little more of that, uh, I don't know. If we have to educate before we ask a little mm -hmm. bit, mm -hmm. okay, briefly to make sure that <laughs> yeah. the questions are yeah, understood. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Well, I'm gonna. I'll work on this sooner as opposed to later. So, um, let's say if if I just email you guys stuff, that you. I mean, I have mm -hmm. to actually well, sometimes yeah, say if you me. email me, please text me. Because I will look at it. Um, but if I just email you, it's chances yeah. are you see it in a couple of days. Okay. Mm -hmm. Because I can, I'll work on sections of this and just put it out and have people. Oh, we comment on it, or yeah. We're here. Change mm -hmm. this. Okay, so we'll, so we'll have something pretty concrete to look at in a couple of weeks. I literally wonder, like, if we're asking about if we're being good stewards of, of the money, if we have to say over the past five years the tax rate yeah. has gone here, 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 here. How do you feel? <laughs> like I, I almost think we have, because I feel like if we just ask, are we being good stewards of the money? And we have so few people that actually come out to vote or come to those informational meetings. I worry that they're going to answer a question without yeah. that they don't really know. Oh yeah, yeah. And or I, there's just the perception that taxes have been going up, and they haven't been. So that's why I wonder so if we need to like. State, it, and so it screwed us up. Well, yeah, that's what right? I'm saying. Like, yeah. WRVSU didn't create inflation. You know, <laughs> like you know, that's the whole thing. Like, also, just because it's important, expensive for us to operate, but it's more expensive for. <laughs> You, Everybody, you, you, yeah. and you to, you know, like. And there's just such a tiny part of the budget that we have control over. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. yeah. it's, so, it's, mm -hmm. it's, it's all fixed points that. Yeah, I mean, I, 
I we can we can take a look at each. We session. could we could beat that Seriously. drum again, like you know, do it's this. It's going to be tough though, because you don't I mean, want to be seen as like in some cases it's reasonable influencing to, um, people either. You know, but I think it's a good place to educate too. Yeah, yeah just oh, the absolutely. facts. Absolutely. Just the facts. No, I think that's fair to try to give. Even if it's a link to the last budget presentation or <laughs> something. <laughs> Got the last one. Just remember that. Um, how do we get it out though? Is that the, the community, community, list? community yeah. list server? Yeah, there's something. I think like front page forum and things like okay. that. Well, so you really, it's like people are really having to kind of opt in, like they rolling it have against to be plugged really into that portal. To I will, them. yeah, I I, I think that that the Herald. paper, <laughs> yeah, the well, we'll have to do it a lot of ways. Yeah, we'll have to do it. I would send it out to you know real estate owners. The, like brand list. We might yeah. have literally leave. I mean, the question is: do we, want, do we want to do a mailing? That would be the send thing. it out with a tax bill. Well, I, I think that that, that may but be. But the tax bill is not going to help. Well. <laughs> yeah. 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 Can we I'm staple the tax bill saving, too? <laughs> saving. Yeah. yeah. Um, well, I think yeah, that's so important, though. Is um, it, um, what did you just say, Andrew? You said either doing if, if we're doing them oh, in order to get it to uh, everybody. Well, our, our demographic our that we're we're really shooting for, if it's the people that may not be as connected online yes, or agree. whatever, you know, like so. I agree with that. I think that's our only thing that we have, like a townwide yeah. list of everybody. Mm -hmm. That's our only, but I, yeah, mm -hmm. it's tricky too because you know we probably do want to. Get some responses from Tunbridge and Chelsea, <coughs> yeah, not just Bethel and Royalton. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Do we? Yeah. Does it matter? Yeah. I mean, well, if if Royalton is really the, like we're if we're trying to be the catch trying to capture yeah. their high school students or yeah. you know middle school students, yeah, absolutely. So well, would they be able to like answer that. these questions? I don't know. Yeah, depends. Yeah, let's yeah. let yeah let's yeah. ponder this one and then we'll t we'll take a look at it once the questions are formed and sort of to make that decision based on that because there's there's some things i mean if we were send it out then you got to figure out how you can get it back yeah yeah you know, no i mean i think you'd send out like a link to do. the website mm -hmm. something like that. for right yeah well there's some the people that are going to need a hard copy and a hard link you know just be like a little like a, a card. postcard yeah. yeah yeah there was some talk about postcardy things mm -hmm. i know but if we're talking about cheaper. some people like my father-in-law got it there's no technology in this house you would have to give him a paper copy <laughs> But I think also, I mean, we've certainly done this in the past. Or I'm sure you have it. You know, is that if you, um, if you'd like a paper copy, yeah. please call blah blah. Yeah, number, yeah. put a phone number here, yeah. and we'll yeah. send you one. I think we'll have to do that. So that's a possibility. Or, bad, like, have them do it over the phone. Yeah. yeah. I was just thinking, old home That'd days is lot. really soon, isn't it? Too it, soon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Too soon. Yeah. What's that? So like, but that's, and it's unfortunate when this has to be done by when collected. I know, and for because Tunbridge Fair booth would collect oh, a lot too. Uh, yeah. Well, I mean, if this Everybody's is the last done. piece of data, I mean, the rest <laughs> of the stuff will be flowing in. We will have done a lot of the analysis. I'm anticipating some of the report will be written. I mean, this may be end up being sort of the last bit of data that we're collecting. Mm -hmm. And so to to think about Tunbridge Fair, um, if we did that, then I might say to Jamie, "How about the October meeting?" Mm -hmm. Well, that, yeah, I was just going to say that may be an but, option to get a blessing to extend it a little, you know, Yeah, I mean, a only, be, only if we're needing more, but I think, um, but yeah, so let's, let, I'll work on this, I'll get some stuff out to you, and uh, so we'll have something more concrete to work off of. So tonight what I wanted to do with the, the teacher and student data, does everybody have access to that on, like, on your electronics? I think you should. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. The student data, I looked at some of the student data, yeah. But not the teacher. Yeah, you know, I read through the teacher that responses. Was way bad, so wasn't it? A lot yeah. of good stuff. <laughs> you know, I certainly found the kind of open ended question answers a lot more useful for that one than kind of the. The teacher one or the student one? Teacher one. Teacher one. Yeah. Um, than the kind of ranking number ones. But. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, the students didn't do much in the open-ended question mm -hmm. side. <laughs> also, it was like um, really the tail end of the year. Yeah. 
How do we actually, okay, response is 50. Yeah, okay. just response. So what I had hoped to do, and this is where, was for folks to take a look either in pairs or individually and just kind of go down and look, look at the pie graphs and, you know, identify what perhaps stood out to you, what, um, okay, this is, this is teaching 101. You're all looking at your stuff and not <laughs> listening <laughs> to me. You've opened yeah. it up and now you're not. <laughs> That's um, why I'm retired. <laughs> Because it's these uh, bad things. I'm reading, reading the really anxious really generation. Anyway, things that, things that jump I'm out to you too. that you, you that huh? just surprise you. Reading um, that anxious. Yeah. And yeah. then Are what you? other questions yeah. does that have that? There's have, data for that, you. Um, Put in your head. Because next time, when I'm, I'm meeting with Ray on Tuesday, and I'm looking for guidance from you based on your... Um, gut feelings about the data and the teacher and student what what are the right now with the data the way it is just in excel just a massive dump is really difficult to manage mm -hmm. but if you were <clears throat> excuse me ask <coughs> excuse me asking a specific question and you wanted it separated by town or in the teacher survey you wanted it separated by numbers um, of years of service you know, or those kinds yeah. of things. How how might you want it to drill down? And what Ray and I will do is work on creating those data sheets where the drill down is the way you want it. So you're not, we're not trying to do that on the fly. Mm. And then we will spend the next meeting picking mm. that stuff apart and having fun with that. But that's what I'm interested in getting from you. So if you can see it, um, you know what, and if you can't, if you want to do that, I can project whatever people want to look at. The high school ones up, I can put whatever people want on. Wait, that's, wait, what are we doing? Which one do you want to look at? Aren't they all together? The well, student ones are separated by so grade middle level? school is separate from the high school. Am I wrong? Did huh? we get oh, any yeah. middle school responses? Yeah, you I have middle that. school responses. Okay. Yeah, I, so I hadn't I... seen that. Yeah. I remember making them do it. So. <laughs> More <laughs> interview. But I don't think I can tell oh, which go. one they are. Nice. It says it right at the top. No, it tells you what. W R V. Oh, right yep, right yep, here. yep. I was just missing the letter difference. So we're starting with that one. Whatever you want, I have all three ready. I don't know, man. Honestly, don't care. Has anyone scanned them? Would it be better to start with the faculty one or with the student one? I would be inclined to start with the teacher, but I don't Yeah, the I think the teacher one is one that we <laughs> Something's not get more information drilling down into things. Probably. You know? I mean, I'm kind yeah. of. I mean, I suppose with the student one, the drill down that I'd be most interested in are do. Students who are from Bethel, South Railton, and tuition towns feel the same about like mm. feeling togetherness and stuff, or does one town feel strongly about that, and then the other towns like, no, I don't feel like mm -hmm. I'm a wild cat or whatever. <coughs> you know, that's kind of the student. That would be the interesting drill down for me is looking at things from each campus uh, or each town of origin. <laughs> um, But other than that, I think the faculty and staff survey is the one. Well, I mean, I guess it's going to be kind of similar where I'd want to see the breakdown by campus and level. That seems like more. the Bethel kids and the Bethel staff, faculty, answers more questions than the Royalton ones. Mm. Ask more questions or there's more responses? More responses. Well, there's more of them, are there not? No. No? no. The other way around. Yeah. The other way around. Yeah. Yeah. So I think like, it has to do with the time of year something. it was oh. given, personally. Everybody's but. fried. Like, we we could make our middle schoolers do it. And like, well, I don't think they could make their high schoolers. <laughs> well, part of that whole data piece is what, what, what does it was. tell us? But, <laughs> yeah. But also, what is it not? You know, what can we not, not really infer? That would be
good. Most people are excited and engaged in their roles at the school. That's, that's, good. that's pretty good. That's I like was, 96%. Also, also that's pretty personally, good. so write down what's surprising in here. I'll just remember it. Um, I'm also curious, with the, personally, the questions that are similar for the staff and for the students, whether or not the responses are the same. Mm -hmm. You know, similar in the response or, or are folks thinking that they're doing one thing and <laughs> actually that's not how it's being perceived. Wow, there are some stark things that jump out, though. I got it right. Not a big fan of sharing staff. That's the one I just looked at and was like, oh, that's very oh, well. clear. What was that? <laughs> sharing staff is the only one where the green is suddenly, oh, suddenly. everyone's disagreeing. So. Uh -huh. No, but is it, I mean, you and I are lucky to have, you know, a thick space. And if you had to run back and forth like I a would leave. <laughs> crazy person. That's what I do. <laughs> you know. Do you know the results from this screen? I mean, that's like right, crazy that's, person. it's 78% of people who disagree I'm gonna that guess that's going wrong. Yeah. yeah. I do wonder about, you know, it's a little tricky because it's not like we presented the alternative because it's not like the alternative is not having someone is probably the alternative, right? Right, exactly. Either not having someone or like we went to three principals, but we increased the support staff. So it's like, do you want to have two fewer behavioral and interventionists in order to have an extra principal? Well, right. That's the whole thing. There's real like budgetary things right. that'll happen depending on. Right. Yeah, so, so it's a little tricky to yeah. look at this, you know, and say. Well, and the only thing I wondered, looking, I'm only partway down in the beginning, but do you really lump the agree and strongly agree together? Because really on a, on a bunch of them where they, they kind of match up, it turns into like 75%, you know, ish. So it's... I, it's like I, kinda long. Yeah. I wish they, the colors were different, but <laughs> it's hard for my brain. <laughs> yeah, I had, to, I had to keep going to the key. Yeah. I want not hold it red and orange question. to be the same. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, I bet this would be hard to see on there. I can't, I'm not having any luck finding it, mm -hmm. What can you find? He's got just the survey, the actual survey, not the... Oh, on the, on the survey, you, you have to... to you it says responses in the middle. Well, it might not on the phone, no. On the oh, I, no, on the, no, even if you're oh. signed into Google, on, on the top of the survey in blue, it says sign in. You, if you're signed in, yeah. You have to sign in in the survey because I signed into my so. WRVS Google account and I got out of it and back it's in it didn't. Problem. You have to sign in on the survey and that'll get you oh. in it. Hmm. Signed. It might be because it might be, it'd be easier to do it on Chrome. Somebody doesn't like the new smart board things. <laughs> well. I, they arrived kind of suddenly. I, I, I think that was the I, issue. Actually, I, I will say that if, if I could have go back and, and answer the, the, the technology piece different, I would have. I, I, I only answered it from a one part of my brain and not when yeah. I, I cheated and looked at some of the, the responses, and I, I definitely would have something different to, to say about it because, yeah, Emily's... Um, statement about it is and I, I yeah I, I didn't like the way it but some of it's my custodian brain right, and some right. of it's if faculty you know like it's hard but, to separate it's ourselves yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay yeah. well we, there are a lot of good responses here this way. Well, you know what let me give it a quick look because now that I'm on the what you're looking for is it did you figure it out 
okay. questions, responses, and settings. And we have responses. Okay. Yeah. Let's see if I get that point and go on through crime instead of through my. Uh, on my <laughs> Apple phone. Oh, see, I've got an Apple phone. Yeah. 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 Okay. At, at the top and blue, I'm telling you. Right, it well, says, I found it. Yeah. Now, maybe I wasn't looking in the right place. Yeah. But I found it now. Thanks, guys. Okay. 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 Okay.
there are more Bethel students or more no, Southboro South students? South students. Do you mean students from those town or do you mean students at the campus? Because those are different answers, I think. Students from those towns. <coughs> there should be more South Royalton students total. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. hmm. They didn't answer. But I think campus wise it's pretty similar, right? I think the problem is you have kids. I don't know that they you can guarantee that we got students that would go to tech centers. Yeah, that's true. And All are in dual enrollment in this captured in this. Although it did say there was one dual enrollment student that answered this question. Hmm. Shared staff, shared staff. Oh, God. Hello. Go away. I want it to be very clear. I believe Ms. Bowen is an amazing principal to work with. However, sharing her, splitting her in half, this makes it difficult. My family would agree too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think it puts I'm you in a really hard position. <laughs> My family doesn't like sharing me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. They don't want to split you either. No. <laughs> <laughs> right down the middle, rip you apart. <laughs> I would be curious to know is the elementary school I was just reading some of the comments further down about like uh, school structure <clears throat> Is it, is the, I mean, I think that it would really be the idea of like reorganizing things and having the two elementary schools and one campus and the other two levels of another campus is really driven by the elementary school, right? Because it doesn't seem like, I mean, I know for me and my colleagues, like no one wants that from the middle school level. So like, I assume that that's the, how high school feels too, but I don't actually know. Like, that is that what? Do you don't want what? Do not want to be with the high school. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Like on the same location. Yeah. Yeah. I just feel like I feel like that quite like it would be interesting to drill down and like see how those things come out a little bit in here to me. Like how are the elementary teachers answering it versus how are other people answering it? Mm -hmm. Which we don't know. Yeah. Like we can't know from this, I think. You would rather have the middle school be not with the high school. Yeah. See, my kids went through the whole because, yeah. all squished together. And, you know, there were problems. You always have older kids bullying the middle school kids, period. I mean, you see it on the bus, I'm sure. Um, yeah. And I like, and see, personally, I would like my kids being in my town elementary school just until they get mm -hmm. their sea legs going to school. <laughs> you know, I don't know how I would have felt if I was in that position. Wow, I've made friends at school with students from other towns. This is the high school kids. It's like 85 percent is yes yeah yeah it's huge. that's important i mean kids, I think it's always about kids by the end of sixth grade you would be hard pressed to figure out who went to which town that's the good. thing that's yeah. good. And people think that's that that's, good. that's how people identify and it's like mm. <laughs> yeah. yeah i went i went to a school district where it was like three elementaries and then one junior high i try to imagine like not having that access to those other social you know groups and like how many yeah. of my best friends came from those other three elementary it was so important yeah and like you know like a tumultuous first year of like finding your place but that's like so part of that developmental phase I feel like you know <clears throat> well, the pride club In is the book wow, it says awesome. kids have to learn to 
like go through that mm -hmm. out on the playground I don't know everybody and I'm gonna yeah. you know make my way we're talking about the anxious generation the, oh, the yeah. book it's very interesting we just started it but yeah very interesting I'm about a third of the way through I'm <laughs> reading two other things so yeah. I, a little bit of that and a little bit of this but it's interesting yeah. mm. Parents are horrible, entitled, and rude. Ooh. Oh my God! Yes. <laughs> I haven't got that <laughs> straightforward. I, I read that. So I think that think? one I read like way. That was a long time ago. Where was that? Yeah. In That's the first one of the family yeah. and community involvement. Oh, wait okay. Where? Okay. Oh. Sure, they're not all terrible. <laughs> horrible. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> Which hat are you wearing? <laughs> <laughs> Oh dear. Um, is this an opportunity for AI? Can we like dump this mm -hmm. into whatever chat GPT? I don't know all the things and like either. be like, please summarize. Like, sure. Does that anyone know AI well enough to well, know? Jeff, Jeff does, right? Jeff Clayton. You know. I mean, I'd want well, to fact, like, yeah. spot check it, but it, yeah. it seems Isn't like there's so much. Isn't that how he really created some of these to begin with? I think yeah, um, I remember him mentioning something yeah. about yeah, AI. I, 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 thought you I, did, I went on and asked how to ask some questions, yeah. Mm -hmm. um. questions we're trying to answer about this. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of information. Like why why do elementary teachers want it seems like many must want a merged elementary and like why? Well, I mean is it just think is it about it. And one campus sometimes is one first grade teacher. Right. right. You've got no right. options. Once you have, and I think what I just read there was like well with both sides, obviously, but I think it's you can vertically connect with the person above you and below you, but you don't necessarily have that. I can just walk down the hall and talk to this other person about, like, how's your pacing going, or I had this hard problem. Mm -hmm. It's a much... And options for kids sometimes. So you, you've got, you know, combinations that just... Well, like, well, like family members, My neighbors, you know. I mean, the North Road is Bethel, South Royalton, you know. My kids didn't know anybody from South Royalton until I brought them to go to nursery school at the children's place mm -hmm. because they either knew the kids from Bethel or Barnard or I worked at the VA so down in White River. So I, I made that point to have them go to nursery school with kids that they would be going to kindergarten, kindergarten with, with yeah. you know. Um, my neighbors send their kids here instead of trucking down to South Royalton for 13 miles, you know, that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Well, so, but we also, I mean, they try to do things as a as a as a unit in the elementary school, and it you know it it turns into a thing, you know, like you have to have the permission slips to go over to Royalton, and, and vice versa, and then to Not you know the get them all over there and find the space, and you know, like and and have the presenter be at Bethel or at Royalton, and try to share those. Time so one yeah. campus doesn't feel. I know, can see like, how that's hard. Yeah, yeah. no, I mean, yeah. I, I see yeah. those points. Oh. 
All right, we've got about 10 more minutes, so I'm not sure what's the best way to do this is whether or not you want to just shoot me an email that has the drill downs that you think you're interested in mm -hmm. or um, questions that have popped up now. And I can put that together and... Are we just going to look at the staff one or all of them? Well, ultimately we'll look at them all, but... Right, I mean, um, for next week or two weeks. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to, I'll encourage you to, to take a look at them at, at home. And if you don't have them, let me know. Well, or I, I, I guess that was going to be them. my next question is like, I'm getting savvy at this, but if we could put them in one email or something, that would, okay. be, yeah. that would be yeah. helpful for me, I think. Me yes. too. So yeah. I'm sorry, your question was, looking at these, what would you, we want to drill down? Yeah. And I'm, I'm going to mess around with spreadsheets to see if I can. I think it would okay. be answer some questions. Better. Yeah, I mean, no. I mean that's basically what I'm going to do with Ray on Tuesday. So let me know what you do. So well, I, I think I'm, the snapshot I'm at right now is the um, family community involvement. And really, it turns into like 75% for the three, the first three questions, and whether it's red or blue is, you know, whatever is agreed or strongly agreed that, you know, they feel that community is involved, but this is from a staff perspective, you, mm -hmm. know, you know what I mean? So it's, it's interesting that we feel and, and maybe that's where we compare is like community doesn't feel engaged or, you know, whatever, when we send the community one out, but it's interesting. Right, that and that's the, you know, I think that there's lots of places where that kind of crossover would yeah. be interesting, where yeah. the, the questions were similar or identical, but a different group of people are, are responding. So are they similar in their response or are they actually pretty I, different? Mm -hmm. I think my, most of my breakdown stuff is going to be how do the two campuses compare? Like, do mm -hmm. both campuses feel equally supported by their families or mm -hmm. the community? The yeah. elementary so, campuses? Hmm. Or, is that what you're thinking? No, not, I mean, just like. I don't think we can, we didn't ask that question, we, I don't think. We can because what one campuses? was, Wait a minute. we did by campus and then we also did, yeah, by, did by program. program. So you could, so, oh, there was a program one? Yeah. yeah. If oh, I yeah. click on. So like, like are all the disagreed ones, ones all high school? Yeah, that, I think right. that would be really yeah. interesting. Uh, right. I don't yeah. think you can do it yeah. here. So. I think you have to. Well, and then too, I mean, I'll get the percentages because I have the the total number. Uh -huh. Like there's yeah, 250 the student whatever, emails yeah. that's where at the high school. Mm -hmm. So if there's 52 responses, uh, and then you can like take uh, the calls. You know, that's only 25 percent of that. Yeah, that's yeah. not good. Yeah. 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 So yeah. it's, yeah. I think it's so still good information. I just have to put it in into context. And I think what it does ultimately is say, and it, this could be part of the report that that this has given us a hint about something. And that it's something that, that or, yeah, we could always, would be worth If we feel like we don't, didn't get good enough response there, we could always repeat it like right. at the beginning of school. Mm -hmm. yeah. Well, it could yeah. even be done right away at the beginning of the school year. Because by that time, we'd know what, exactly what we were looking for. So And a lot of the classes so have down. a makeup that gives them a, a sort of like a reputation. They're not, you know, like the ninth graders this past year, mm -hmm. the boys were really, you know. Yeah, no, every class is different. Every, year, you know, yeah, Remember your reputation, they were in kindergarten? and that they haven't changed. <laughs> but you know, um, like to see what the responses were from mm -hmm. that class, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. just to what are we missing <laughs> with them that they need more support or some other. Well, yeah. yeah one fine. of this, one of these is the the re middle school preparing kids for yeah, high school, yeah, and it was yeah. they were the high school people were kids were very critical. Yeah. Um, but that's you know. Well, that's good. They see that to me they, is if they can talk to the freshmen and sophomores and say, "What did you need mm -hmm. that you didn't get?" And maybe it's not even possible. Yeah. Yeah. Could you be know? The, just the makeup. Could yeah. just be. It's too different. I also would be curious, I mean, I, it would be curious to know who who answered this, like what grade. What grade levels, it. exactly. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. So, uh, you know, we can drill down on that yeah. and just get those yeah. separated out. But. Um, There's a lot of information here. Yeah. Yeah, it's overwhelming, and it's overwhelming in this format. So the more that you can, if you've got, you know, an hour to kill, um, just 
what are the questions and I mean even anything like that that you can give me that we can I can play with and try to get it in a more um, it's, it's all about how to how to format the data yeah It's cool to have so much data. Yeah. I was actually thinking, uh, I don't know if she'd be interested in it, but there is a statistics class that's taught at the high school. I'm curious if they would be interested in this data. Oh, wow. Why not? Might surprise them. Get them to look at the YRBS data. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> That's the problem. They're all in one classroom. <laughs> They also, what was really nice was that the, there was a very high percentage, I think, in the 80% of kids about saying that they had a significant, at the high school, a significant adult yeah. at the school. I, I mean, was that looking, was, at, that's I was a, looking at that. That's the, a huge the, win. Pa yeah. Parents that's a saw, huge I mean, win. Uh, faculty said that they felt community and engagement, and then the, there was, uh, I forget the other question, but it was all very, like, in the red. Like, it was definitely yeah. very, like, they felt like there was a lot of community engagement. Yeah, sorry, this is an overwhelming moment, but we'll get it. We'll get it. <laughs> Someone will figure it out. <laughs> All right. Everybody write 20 pages on this. There you go. The no. Court. The other thing, Andrew, yeah, if well. you, I'm going to, I have seen those questions. Maybe, did you write the questions for the, um, about the voting? Uh, I'm going to, I... Probably Maybe they're in an email. email. Honestly, point, I've yeah. seen it someplace. I'll go yeah. back and look. Because yeah. um, it was really well done. Could you just briefly speak? Andrew and I were talking, and she said that you knew how to, or could, can we, we play around? We, if, or, I don't think we can do, like, if you want to make it look like this, no, you can. Right. No, no, no. But no, you no, can go to the no. graph. Right. 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 Yeah. We going to, if we, uh, if we go to sheet, if we go to sheets, you would go here, right? Right. Uh, I can't. I, Never mind, we can't. Oh, we can't. <laughs> no, I was messing around with that. I was able to download oh, yeah. so we don't have access to Excel. To it. Yeah, That's, I think. No, we do have access to the data. But, like, we can't. I don't know why I can't. Why, you know, why can't I we don't do know it why you can't. <laughs> yeah. The same reason we well, can't email. Right. Oh, we know. Run <laughs> for office, then they'll let you in. I think it was one of those. I think, right. actually, That's Mary true. might own them all. Right. But and it's so that I can look Mary's like the problem. This, we'll just but not do this. Yeah, it's you probably have like. Yeah, that is strange. Just a question. I, I mean, it. are you able to edit the survey? Because my guess is you don't have. Edit. Oh, I it was initially. So maybe you were it last or maybe oh, yeah. not that particular yeah. one. You were working on the yeah. family, so yeah. 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 I'll get. I'll contact Mary. Question. She's away, but she's got her stuff and get oh, this stuff sent to you. I had to redo it, Andrea, and now I can see it in the table. What did you hit? I just had had to reopen it. I don't know why. Google. And then I just want to make but sure now that, I'm seeing it in that if we're all going to play, I mean, I think it's okay for all of us to play with it. I just want to make sure that whatever like we started with has been, <laughs> so we have an original mm. that is saved the way it is right now. I think like before. every time a different person opens it, you're basically mm. making your own copy. Yeah. 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 So, or, or maybe it's, it's right. like, where it's is that one? Yeah. 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 It's just attached to that. You were? Yeah. 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 Everyone has a screen. I'm all have a cough. All right, you guys. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Um, we need to officially. Are we going to? Um, Bravo. All those in favor? Bye. 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 <laughs>